Sky Live Grid. It's a wonderfully laggy place to be. Recently, I got a chance to check out Skylife Grid, which is a virtual world that runs on OpenSim or Open Simulator. OpenSim grids are like alternative grids to Second Life, and Skylife Grid is one of them. When I visited Skylife Grid, it had no users in world, 75 regions, a total of 44 users, and 52 active users in the last 30 days, which means that Skylife Grid is not a very active grid. The first place that I was taken to when I first logged in to Skylife Grid was the welcome area and it's called Skylife Welcome Center. To my surprise, the welcome area is pretty good because it had almost everything a new user needs. It had free textures, free starting avatars, free animation overrides, teleports to Skylife destinations, a couple of game boards, and a bar for hanging out. The one thing that was not great about Skylife Grid was the lag. There was nobody else in the welcome center and yet I was lagging badly. Of course, it could be just my internet connection and my location to the server but still, I shouldn't be lagging that bad especially when I don't get that much lag in Second Life. Anyway, because of the bad lag, I was only able to look around the welcome area or welcome center. I'm sure there are places to visit in Sky Life Grid but unfortunately, I won't be doing any of that. Bad lag means bad experience but it doesn't mean that if I'm lagging in Skylight Grid then you will lag as well. No, it could be the reverse. Who knows, maybe it will not lag as bad for you. That's it for this video and if you have any comments, questions or reactions then please post them in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to like this video, share it to your friends and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching and see you in my next video. Second, second Life Trolling Here life is another simple way of stopping Second Life Trolls from ruining your day in Second Life. Place.